All right, once you have your render for your model, you're gonna to wanna to go over and change the material. Switch that to a flat color. Make sure your color's cranked up all the way to white. Also gonna to wanna to switch on polyframe, switch off all colors on the subtools. Make sure you then render it out. You got your mask and you've got your wireframe. When we jump over here over to Photoshop, we are going to have all three, bring them all in. You got your mask, wireframe, and color render. You want to put a multiply on that wireframe and you can adjust it accordingly if you want black. Now, if you want white, go to image adjustments and invert, and you're going to switch that over to a screen from a multiply to a screen. And now if we, we want to use that mask, we're going to combine the wireframe and the color. And we're going to use that mask to get rid of all the black and allow us to get a controllable background for ourselves. Just paste that into the mask and then we can do some form of a gradient or whatever we choose here on our, our separate layer as our background. We are then able to go in and really fine tune here. You can click and just change the opacity depending on how much you want. You can also add a level adjustment if you want to crank it up a little bit. And there you go.